hey guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to learn how to do the base setup and how to set the margin and how to insert the header and footer in excel so before starting this video i would like to request you to please like comment and share my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon in order to get the notification of my upcoming video so let's start now first of all we need to open one excel file you can see i am opening an excel file so for printing this excel file you go to this file menu, file menu print then print preview you can see this print and uh, this form is not fit in one paper it's fit already but it's not set see this upside is out already this right side is more more margin and left side is less margin so you need to do this setting so go to the page manager page setup manager you can found here first option is orientation and first set this select this orientation for example if your uh, format is in portrait mode so you can set the portrait if your format is in landscape mode so you can just click on this landscape okay then second option is a scaling so as for a scaling you just make it hundred percent and third option is page size you can select as per your requirement the page size from here either it is later or E3 or E4. Okay. Then go to this margin second tab. Go to this margin and set the margin. Top, left, right, and bottom margin. So top right, top margin is 0 0.35. Left margin is 0 0.25. Right margin also 0 0.25. And then bottom margin is also 0 0.25 then click ok you can see this already arranged and set in one page now you can simply click on print ok simply click on print and give the file name save as on its desktop now you can see that file it's already saved here just open it and once you print you can found the same okay on the paper now i have another sheet i want to set here this company name logo on the top of this form and bottom side I want to set the page number and date so to do this we need to insert the page uh, footer and header so to insert the header and footer we need to go to print preview again so shortcut of print is control P go to this preview you can see this top side is nothing no company name no logo nothing is there so to insert that logo in company name go to this page setup manager then go to header and footer select custom header you can see there are three sections here left section you need to insert the company logo and center section you you have, you should type this company name and format type so just click on this left section to insert this logo just click on this insert picture and then select the logo okay. then go to the center section just type the company name
final inspection form okay now you need to increase this font size just select this go to this font you can select this font type you can select any one of this font real black whatever you want you can select it and then font style you can select italic bold and bold italic whatever you want you can select okay i'm selecting the bold and then you select this size font size keep it 20 if you want to underline this font just click on this underline there are two options single and double so i i interest you I, my interest is to underline double so i'm clicking on the double and uh, you can change the color also from here select blue whatever you want you can select i'm selecting red and then okay you can see this logo and company name is already inserted in this paper okay so this is called footer if you close this you cannot see here that company name and logo in this file that will be shown only in the print preview okay see it is showing here Now I am interested to put this footer. I am interested to insert the page number and date. So I am going again page setter manager custom footer. And, and again you found here three section left section center and right. Wherever you want you can put. I want to put this page number in the left section. Just click on the left side. Insert page. right side I want to put date in center I want to put time okay just click ok and ok you can see space number time and date is already arrived if you want to change this style again go to this manager custom and footer so go to this here footer top down simply click on print reader and footer now you can see it's already saved here I hope you guys learned something from this video. So my request to you to please like, comment and share my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel and as well as please press the bell icon in order to get the notification of my upcoming video. So thank you for watching this video. Thank you very much.